Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to the video. This is Anthony. And if you're watching this, this is because we just hit 10,000 followers on the Instagram account. If you guys aren't aware, right now I'm doing a challenge where I am trying to grow my personal Instagram from zero to 100,000 followers in 30 days. And we are documenting the entire process. We just hit the first milestone of getting the first 10,000 followers. And on this video, I'm going to be doing an interview with the partner that I have that I am working with on this Leo. Um, we've been working on this project tirelessly. Um, we're trying to make everything come together trying to perform the best strategies to make this growth go as fast as possible And I'm super excited to be interviewing him today. Um, if you guys don't know you're not aware We do have a wait list for this. We give out free tips uh, free tricks We give out early announcements uh, everything you need basically if you want to really watch us document this uh, Day to day and you want the day-to-day -day updates and, and track exactly where the accounts at and literally see an account be grown in front of you Then you want to join the wait list the wait list will be the first link in the description All you have to do is click it and it signs you right up and then we give you push notifications straight to your messenger with that said i hope you guys enjoy this interview oh we also have rules for the challenge so obviously you guys know i have a network uh leo has a massive network we have put rules in place that limit us where we can't use a certain amount of money we can't use uh, a certain amount of our network if you want to skip straight to the rules and just know the rules of the competition then go ahead and uh in the description i will say where to go to go ahead and skip to the rules if not go ahead and watch the entire video and you will see the rules as well hope you guys enjoy this all right guys what is going on i am now here with leo leo is the person that i am doing this zero to 100k challenge with um leo has like i said before a massive instagram agency he's done really tons of cool things and today i want to get him on here um talk about some of the things he's done talk about this challenge talk about the rules for the challenge which we'll talk about at the end if you guys want to go straight to the rules i'll leave uh in the description a little timestamp to go straight to the rules um but with that said leo thanks for uh taking some time out of your day Thank to you. actually come here and and uh and do something for my viewers here Thank you, man. I'm glad to be here and I'm um, looking forward to share some value with you. My name is Anthony. I run an Instagram marketing agency and also run a million follower network on Instagram. And I make videos like this to help you take your Instagram account from zero to hero. So make sure you subscribe because this is the Instagram hub. All right, so one main thing that I really want to talk about here is um, what you did with the whole Ty Lopez thing. So I know I've kind of talked about it a little bit before, but I really just want you to talk about it and like through your eyes, like how exactly it happened. Because I think that is one of probably the most, you know, apart from the agency stuff and apart from everything else you're doing, like traveling around and everything, I think that's probably like one of your biggest accomplishments. Like it's just something so cool to talk about. So can you like kind of like tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so um, I was watching Ty's videos for quite some time, you know, and he was really someone that I looked up to. Um, I know a lot of people don't actually like him, but you can't deny the fact that he has so much knowledge. Um, he's done very well for himself in regards to business and wealth. And I was like, wow, I'd love to meet this guy one day, you know? So I, I literally, like I was consuming his content every day and then eventually got to a point where he released this, uh, this course. And I remember instantly I bought it just like that. I was like, I wanna, just learn from him, you know? So I bought the course and I remember like getting involved with it. I was doing the homework every weekend. And um, eventually, uh, one, someone from Ty's team was uh, like calling everyone inside this course. So I got on this call um, and he was basically checking up whether or not we had done the, the homework uh, for, this, for this course. So I had a chat with the guy and I was pretty excited, pretty nervous. And um, I remember he, the, the guy was asking me um, about myself, what I've been getting up to, what I've done, etc., etc. And then when I told him that I'd built a 2 million follower network, he was like, holy shit, that is insane, right? And then he asked me, how old are you? And I, was, I think at the time I must have been um, 18, right? And as soon as I said that, he was like, that's insane. You know, I mm -hmm. want to fly you straight out to Thai so you can come meet him and do all of this stuff. And like literally in that moment, like I can't explain how, <laughs> like how I felt, but it was insane, you know, um, and that's, that's pretty much what happened. Right. So it's kind of so combining, uh, like buying, buying into Ty's course, getting on that call to, with that guy to see if you did your homework and then by him seeing what you were able to produce at such a young age, it, it kind of gives people that wow factor. So what? So he, then they invited you to basically go out to to go to Ty's mansion. 
yeah, that's it. And like, I think within a week, I went straight out there. Um, I didn't really have too much money at the time, but I, I thought, fuck it, you know, I've uh, got to make the most out of this. So, um, <laughs> yeah, went straight out a week later and, and that was it. Right, right. How do you think by going there and doing that and talking there and networking with those people, like, did it, how, how much did it propel your business forward? Was it something worth oh, it? Oh, man. Oh man, like I can't even start with how much it propelled me forward, you know, because before I used to just hustle on Instagram mm -hmm. in my room and I didn't know that was anything other than my room, you know, so this brought it to reality. I went straight there and um, like everyone there were like multi-millionaires. I was like, holy shit, how did I end up in this situation? And literally, as soon as I got back to London, um, I started to get right back on the hustle. You know, the first month I got back, was the first ever month I made $10,000 from Instagram. So nice. that kind of proves the power of, of, of me flying out there and networking with such high, high, um, high value people. So yeah. Right. It gets you thinking in that different way. And then the second you hit that first oh, five definitely. figure month, it, it, it changes a lot of things. Like yeah, 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 your definitely. mindset changes, your work ethic changes, everything changes, but that's awesome. Okay, so you mentioned before that when you were flying out to Thai, you had mentioned that you had a, a follower network of 2 million then? That's right, yeah. So can you kind of walk us through the space of that was oh, what, almost two years ago now? Uh, that must have been a year, about a year ago, year and a half ago. A year and a half ago. Around so that from that time where your agency was at then to now, how has it changed? Like, what, what is what is the different circumstances? We know what's the network at now? What are the results you could produce? Yeah, so right now the network, uh, so I've got a personal network of 4 million followers. These are all theme pages. And I also manage a 56 million follower network. So these are all the biggest theme pages on Instagram and I essentially use them to my advantage to grow clients accounts. So yeah. So within a year and a half, you've gone from a 2 million follower network to a 4 million personal network that you own and managing a 56 million follower network in a year and a half. That's right. That's, that's yeah, the yeah. thing I love. Like Instagram is so new and, and I think even social media in general is so new, but Instagram is so new. It doesn't take much time to get to the top in this industry. Definitely. Like that's, yeah. that's what I keep trying to tell it's people. I'm like, network. look, like, yeah, like, you know, like the average business takes five years to break even. I'm like, dude, on Instagram, nah. within five years, you're at the top of the food chain. Like Straight you excel away. so fast. It, it's literally all it takes is work ethic. And I mean, obviously you just decided to buckle down and put in that work ethic. Like all it takes- Work ethic and networking, you know? That's networking it. Networking is a big part of it as well. A so. few years of making some sacrifices. And in your case, a year and a half. And you've gone, you've gone from basically a little skimpy 2 million follower network, which is still great. Like, dude, 2 million followers is awesome. So if any of you guys are at 2 million or less than 2 million, keep grinding, keep doing your thing. But in the span of a year and a half to go from 2 million to managing 56 million with a 4 million personal, I mean, it's just astounding. It's it's, it's amazing. But um, <laughs> Thank you, man. You got it. So who who do you, I don't know if you can say this or anything, but is there any names you can drop people that you're actually growing or managing so everybody can like kind of take a look at it, check it out and, and, see, and see what your agency is actually managing? Any like big people that you can talk about? Yeah, so I can drop a few names. Um, I can't get into all of the clients I'm currently working with. I have done campaigns for Ty Lopez in the past. Um, I've also, uh, I also helped Gary V launch his uh, new shoe or sneaker as you guys probably call it, uh, the clouds and dirt. I've also worked with uh, the big watch company, Daniel Wellington, done several campaigns for them. And most of my clients uh, are paying up to $30,000 at a time. So the agency is going pretty well. Jeez, 30, what, what is the most amount of ad spend you've had to manage for an Instagram campaign at one time? At one time? Um, to be honest with you, it's got to be thirty thousand dollars. That's the biggest I've handled because I've the way I've structured it is that I only take clients at max thirty thousand dollars so far. Right, right, gotcha. That well, that's a, that's a lot of, especially on Instagram, that's a lot of money flowing to ads and to influencers and stuff like that for growing pages. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. 
So many of you guys probably don't know this, but I've actually known Leo for quite a quite a while. Um, I remember we were like when we were in the building phases of really trying to figure out Instagram. We were kind of right there, like bouncing some ideas off of each other. Um, I know Leo, you were killing it with selling tons of accounts. I think you know that's what really connected us. We were like selling Instagram accounts like crazy, like trying to like partner up and and stuff like that. But we actually go a, a pretty far back. We just kind of split because we had a little bit of like different views. I kind of went more down a personal branding route and. Uh, uh, Leo went down super hardcore um, agency route, but Leo, do you want, kind of want to say like how um, you know our, our little because we actually had an agency together. Leo, I don't know if you want to talk about the the agency we had going for a little bit. Yeah, for sure. So um, I met Anthony. Oh, it must have been over a year or well, around a year and a half ago now. To be honest with you, um, it must have been around May last year. So. Like when I first started out, I was just like, um, I think we were both struggling quite a bit, to be honest. Um, struggling with we the whole still, viral, like, viral thing, trying to figure out how to go viral. The whole viral thing, trying to figure out how to grow pages, right. you know. Because I've, been on, uh, I've, I've we, been on Instagram, I think I've been on Instagram longer than you. But I, I've been trying to find the viral method and crack it, like sh yeah, around yeah, the yeah. same time. But I've been doing Instagram That's since right, high school. Yeah. But the viral method yeah, was, was, was a little new to me. Yeah, yeah. Instagram was fairly new to me, you know, at the time. So I was still trying to figure it all out and understand how this all works. But um, yeah, so this, like about a year and a half ago, um, I was still hustling. I was still trying to figure out how this all works. I think um, the biggest page must have been 100,000 followers at the time. And uh, things were going pretty good. And then obviously I, I, I stumbled into you. You reached out to me on Facebook and um, we figured out that we were both killing it or Barely killing it, I guess. Right, right. And then, um, so yeah, then around um, October time last year, I remember me and you, we were both like, let's start an agency. Right. And I remember at the time, you must have been working in Dunkin' Donuts, I think. I, yeah, I was, I was like still that. in university. And um, we were like, let's just work on a big project and just drop out and just like become rich. That was basically our goal. Mm -hmm. And do very well with Instagram, you know. Um, so I remember we, we started off this agency and um, it was kind of slow the first day, obviously. Right? <laughs> but then I remember we started to pick up the pace and um, uh, we managed to close three clients. It must have been three clients in the first week. It was insane. Yeah, no, we had a, we had a, I will say we had a great closing process. We like, had a great. We would <laughs> double close on the phone. And I think we, we closed, like we had a pretty high closing rate. Like Very high. for the amount of clients we talked to, to the amount of clients we closed, I think we did a really good job. Like that was a, yeah, that was yeah. some amazing stuff. It must have been like three out of four. It was right. like crazy. We, we probably signed like what, like six, seven clients total. That's probably the total yeah. amount we signed within like two months. Yeah, it was absolutely insane. Right, and then we and split. Then I, <laughs> yeah, and then I remember like within a week, we had all this success and then I noticed Anthony was more focused on his YouTube channel and it was like, uh, and I was very focused on the agency. Mm -hmm. We both had equal amount of input of work, but um, kind of decided that, um, li like to split paths, you know, um, Anthony wanted to focus on his YouTube channel and, and grow it up to where it is right now. And I wanted to just hustle mm -hmm. and understand like influencer marketing and um, how I can deliver results for clients and stuff. Right. So we went down our, our, our own routes and um, and now I guess we've we've joined forces again right. um, to work on something absolutely insane. Right, so, exactly. Well, you went down that hard because I wanted the agency. I was I was pretty for it. I mean, I, I still run my, you know, my agency. It's, it's nowhere near the size of, of Leo's though and the numbers that you guys are pulling in each and every single month. But I was more, as Leo said, more of the personal branding type. I really liked making videos. Um, I liked educating people and I really liked selling Instagram accounts. So that's the route I went down. And then Leo basically went down the route of, of building a highly profitable Instagram agency doing very large campaigns and everything like that. And now it's just perfect because now, you know, Leo has the means and you have the know-how and the skills to go ahead and, and with working with all the accounts you've done, all the campaigns you've run, you know how to take very little ad spend and turn it into a lot of followers in return and little hacks and stuff. And I know a lot about personal branding now and how to use pin stories, how to convert more followers back in monetization strategy. So this is going to be absolutely epic. Um, I, I think I'm it's so going to be awesome. Excited. Actually, I mean, we're basically coming down to the topic of the challenge. So um, the challenge, I mean, if any of you guys, I'm sure everybody watching this and at least watching this far into this knows what the challenge is. Um, but the challenge is 
is growing my personal Instagram page from zero to 100,000 followers um, in 30 days. Now, the only reason we're kind of using mine is just because I'm kind of more out there already. Leo, I know you're kind of a little bit more behind the scenes, but you're going to start building your personal brand. Actually, where can people find you right now if uh, to get in yeah, contact? Yeah, so right now you can hit me up on Facebook. My name's Leo Ahmed. Um, I reckon Anthony will put it in the description mm -hmm. so you guys can check it out and drop me a message if you have any questions. So, yeah. Perfect. But um, I am planning to start my my personal brand uh, January next year. Definitely. For Instagram. So, guys, yeah. go um, when this video is done or right now, whenever you guys really feel like it, go add Leo on Facebook now because when this guy builds his personal brand, he's going to be dropping tons of value right tons and tons yeah, of value I'm sure, I'm sure you will be all right plan. so you actually you, you actually put out a couple facebook stuff guys the, the stuff that this dude puts out in facebook statuses is is what you find in two thousand dollar instagram courses seriously like there's more value in his facebook statuses than than some instagram courses i took years back um it, it's insane just make sure you're taking advice from the right people leo's definitely a guy you guys want to take advice from um but yeah so the rules for this challenge all right we've actually laid down a couple of rules because i mean leo how leo what's your network again 50 what uh 56 million right followers. now if we just tapped into that network and we just like ran tons of money to like that's it's cheating man because other because you know most that's people can't true, do yeah. it we want to do something where it's kind of like you know like almost anybody could do this you know if you have a little bit of money and you have the uh, most important thing is the education if you have the education of how to Definitely. do it then you can go ahead and you could you could probably do this you could probably follow this challenge too you can make your own 30-day challenge if you really wanted to um so we set some rules that is basically going to limit the amount of money we can use uh limit the fact that leo has an agency basically put limits on us so that it's as if we are the normal average instagram user looking to build a personal brand uh so with that said we've come up with four very big rules obviously we could go down into 20 little tiny rules but we're like what are the big big rules that we want to stick by and uh these are the four that we've came up with the first rule that we have come up with is one we want to complete this in 30 days or less um that doesn't really cap us to uh being the average instagram user but it's kind of like the challenge we want to put ourselves so the first rule is we have to complete this in uh 30 days or less i mean i don't know if we get it in 40 days i'm not going to be unhappy I about mean, it but it's just that kind yeah, of target yeah, yeah. you got to have goals right <laughs> definitely yeah it's going to be tough um it's gonna i mean who knows what's going to happen we'll just have to wait and see what do you think is realistic because i was saying like okay if this is a theme page 30 days is definitely realistic but i mean honestly i have never seen anyone do this before so uh we're going to be breaking a record here if we do this <laughs> so honestly i i don't know what to say to be honest we're just gonna have to go with the flow see what happens and and obviously go all out yeah you know? oh for so. sure like like I think realistic for this is like 60 to 90. So if we get 30. Realistic. Is wow. I don't even know if what I'm going to say. If we get it, oh, than, I couldn't even imagine like 27, 28 days or even, like I said, even 30, even 35 days. Like it's just insane. Yeah, but that yeah. is rule number one. Why don't you go ahead and tell uh, everybody what rule number two is? Yeah. So rule number two is that we can't use our existing network. So as you guys know, I've already got this 56 million follower network that I'm growing clients with and I'm growing my own pages with um, but I think it's a little bit unfair if we leverage of this because of course you guys don't have a network of that size so we want to show something realistic uh, that you guys can potentially do yourself um, so the plan is that we're just going to go ahead and do this from scratch without using our network so that is rule number two. Right. So all the connections that Leo has, all you guys know, I have about a one, almost two million follower network now, um, personal network. I will not be tapping into that. We will not be tapping into anything of Leo's network. Every single influencer that we promote on um, or ad that we run is, is uh, one that we've personally reached out to, one that we have no prior um, cooperation or any prior relationship with. Everything is from scratch. Definitely. We're gonna be messaging the people from scratch. Um, actually, if you, we're gonna be giving away a, a little like free checklist list of some of the best things to say to influencers to get their attention we'll, we'll do that on the wait list if you have if you guys haven't gotten on the wait list yet make sure you hop on the wait list because that's where all the updates are going that's where all the videos are going um that's also where this yeah. checklist is going to be this checklist is specifically just for the wait list we're going to do like the best headlines that you guys can use to actually grab influencers attention um the same head headlines that we're going to use to like basically you make the influencer read your message um and that goes right into rule number three which rule number three is yes we're using influencers Influencers, but we are not going to be using more than two thousand dollars of ad budget we cannot exceed two thousand um, dollars 
for an account like this to go zero to 100k in 30 days we need money like that's that's just it like the, it, without money like maybe we could get like 40 50k in 30 days but without it there's no way we could grow and get that explosive growth so fast yeah. at the same time we don't want to go ahead and dump six seven thousand dollars into it so like what is a number that people maybe would be saving up for two or three months to do a massive campaign we figured two thousand dollars is like the average person would probably save that up over the course of three four months and so that is what we will use we will only use a budget of two thousand dollars for influencers ads or any other type of paid services to grow the account okay so rule number four is that we can't use follow and follow yes it's probably going to get us an extra ten thousand followers maybe twenty thousand but um honestly it's not what we preach you know um follow and follow um will probably lower the engagement in the long run so we've decided that we're not going to use that right for what we want to do we want to have an account that after all this is said and done we don't want to just have the account that went zero to 100k in 30 days and now has a ton of follow and follow people on following it we want the account that was grown the right way that was grown the professional way that can actually be used to make money now right something that we can actually monetize Definitely. not only do we want do i want to just grow this account zero to 100k and then just have it be that i want to use this account to drive traffic make money send people to offers build an email list build up the youtube channel more yeah. like use it for all sorts of different things so that is why we're not going to be using anything like follow and follow or any other type of like short little shortcuts to maybe get an extra 5k or 10k real quick right we're in it for the long term you gotta see this thing grown or uh professionally um and, and basically see it grown the right way we're at the end our goal is to maintain the standard engagement rate of two percent anything above that is going to be amazing but that's really what we want to hold is definitely a two percent engagement rate with we'll follow and follow we won't be able to do that and we won't be able to make as much money out of the account in the long run so guys that is the rules for the zero to 100k challenge um again make sure you hop on the waitlist for the checklist and another video that's going to come out with me and leo which will definitely probably be uh rolled out on the waitlist first so make sure you go and check it out um for all the updates and everything else like that so leo i just want to thank you so much for going ahead and getting on here and taking some time out of your day to 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 do this interview yeah for sure Awesome. Well, with all that said, guys, make sure you drop this video a like. Make sure you hop on the waitlist. Make sure you comment down below uh, any questions you have, anything you guys think, or anything like that. Uh, keep grinding, keep hustling, and I'll see you all on the next one.